Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to the Nine Malls Gadget Review Channel. Today I'm gonna review the Annie Organic Vegan Mac Pasta Sauce, Pasta and Sauce Cheddar Flavor, certified organic from Annie's. And these little kind of portable snack containers of macaroni, and I guess in this case, macaroni and cheese is in quotes because this is the vegan mac, so it's a little bit different, but thought I'd review this because all when I review these portable snack packs of macaroni and cheese, um, they always get a lot of review or a lot of views. So I uh, decided to do this one because I haven't had this one and it looked interesting. If it actually is good, maybe I'll get it again. So let's review it, see if it's actually good. And I've never had vegan macaroni and cheese before, so it'll be quite interesting. It says microwave in, in or microwave for two minutes. USDA organic, whole grain, eight grams or more per serving, it says. Made with goodness, no artificial flavors or synthetic colors, plant-based recipe. And let me, I'm really curious about the ingredients. It says wheat flour, whole grain wheat flour, organic tapioca starch, organic corn starch, organic palm oil, organic rice syrup, solids, organic coconut oil, organic natural flavor, pea protein, it's interesting. It's always, you know, um, you know, it's said to be healthy to be vegan. You know, a lot of people say that, but it seems like some of the, you know, processed foods have way more ingredients uh, than, you know, the normal, you know, macaroni and cheese or something like that. All right. So all you have to do is remove the lid and seasoning packet. Set aside. You will see loose white powder in the pasta. It says, add cold water to the fill line. Microwave on high for two minutes. Do not drain and stir in seasoning packet. Let's stand one to two minutes. All right, so here we go. Oh yeah, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. If you do nothing else, just like and share my content with your friends and family. You can support me on Patreon, patreon.com slash nymalls. That's in the description. Get exclusive videos, fail videos, things like that. Um, things that will never see the light of day are on the Patreon. Also, if you want to know what my top 10 products I've ever reviewed of all time, I have a new book and that's on Amazon. You can see it in the Amazon link. So just click on that and you'll see a link to the book. So check that out. Really appreciate it. And yeah, the book is only $2.99. So, cause I get that question asked a lot. A lot of people have asked me, what are your favorite products? You know? And so I decided to write it down. So if you're interested, if you're one of those people that asked that question, Now's a good time to pick up that book. And there's an ebook and paperback, so check that out. All right, so let's put this in the microwave, and here we go. All right, that's what it looks like out of the microwave. It boiled over in the microwave, so I'm definitely gonna have to clean that up. Keep that in mind. It may create kind of a mess in the microwave, but luckily it's only, I guess, mostly water. All right, the cheese packet. Stir it up. So far, so good. It doesn't look overly watery or anything like that. It smells good, it smells cheesy. It's amazing, this is fake cheese. Yet it smells and looks like normal macaroni and cheese. All right, so I'm gonna let sand one to two minutes and allow the seasoning to melt. Stir again until the sauce is smooth and creamy, it says. Vegan Mac cheddar flavor. Check that out. The color looks a little off. That could just be because it's organic. But yeah, check that out. It's not that super bright <laughs> yellow-orange color of Kraft macaroni and cheese that you remember. All right, so here we go. Let's test out the Annie's Vegan Mac and Cheese. Does it taste as good as the real thing? Here we go. So I'm gonna stir it up a little bit. I haven't had this. It's been sitting for about two minutes. But yeah, you can see it's kind of cheesy. It looks like cheese. If someone said, this is fake cheese, you wouldn't believe them because it's stringy like cheese. I don't know if you can see that when it kind of drops down. You can see those little strings hanging there. All right, so here we go. Three, two, one. How does it taste? Because that's the most important thing. Texture-wise, it tastes a lot like... <laughs> Texture-wise, it's a lot like cheese. Taste-wise, macaroni and cheese 
It doesn't come close, I would say. It's not it's not even the same ballpark as the normal cheese. I would say if anything it kind of tastes weedy, like wheat noodles. It kind of tastes earthy, but cheese, I would say, what's up with this? If I got this, if someone said this is cheese macaroni, I'd say, what's going on? This doesn't taste anything like the normal macaroni cheese that I've had before. So, if you're vegan and you want something close to macaroni and cheese, I'd say go for it because the texture is there. It's not like it's bad or anything like that. It has a rich flavor. It's creamy. It just does not taste like Kraft macaroni and cheese that you're used to, or even the you know normal Annie's uh, mac and cheese. So, or the regular you know Annie's mac and cheese. So I would say, if you're vegan and you want something to try out, I'd say go for it. I mean, this was on sale for a buck, so it's not like it's going to break the bank or anything. But if you're someone that's looking for macaroni and cheese and maybe you just want a vegan version of it, I would say pass because I don't think you'll be happy. It's not exactly what, you know, the flavor is not exactly what you're looking for. Texture, pretty good, pretty good match, but the flavor is just not there. So let me know what you think. Have you had the Annie's Organic Vegan Mac Cheddar flavor? Let me know, leave in the comment section, or just like my videos, share with your friends and family, uh, support me on Patreon, patreon.com slash Nymals. And if you want to know the top products that I've ever reviewed on my channel, the top 10 products, check out my book that's in the uh, Amazon description to check that out. And until next time, I'll see you later.